what is up youtube it is anime analyst here and i'm giving you a naruto chapter 646 review and all i can say is damn this chapter got so in depth and i'm just can't even believe i'm reading naruto anymore this chapter got so dark i was just like am i reading some sort of horror story or something like this actually got me to like i actually like fucking looked at my fucking uh title again because i was like this couldn't be naruto but this chapter ends off where obito left off in the last chapter expelling a juby from his body and i thought he was just gonna like try to control it or tame it or something but no the juby takes the form of a tree and the eight tails and forms be that this is the god tree, the Juby's final form. So we're just like, whoa, what the fuck? So as soon as we get informed about this, branches start whipping away, grabbing people, sucking them dry of their chakra. And we're just like, the hell? And then Madara comes to inform us that the god tree is the originator, the origin of chakra. All the chakra everywhere in the world, even Madara's, even Hashirama's came from the god tree and everyone's just like nobody knew about this except madara so madara's like the old wise man for once so he's telling you guys about how the people used to be like us and they used to fight with with their just mortals basically regular ass people and then they used to praise the god tree that was once in the land so a devil fruit or whatever it's called a forbidden fruit dropped from the tree and some princess ate it or some shit and she got chakra and she ended the war so her son ended up getting chakra when he was born and the juby is mad like you taking my shit bitch i'm like why the fuck you taking my shit and now all these mortals got my fucking power so she so she had a son and we find out the sage's name is some weird ass name like it's haguramo Utusaku Otsutsuki He is the sage of six paths And he tames the beast And the rest is history that you guys already know And Madara tells everybody this And he's like How the fuck do you know this Like this nigga just going off about All this stuff He's like it's written on their Chia Stone monument And it's just like the Uchiha, he has no, he's been in another zone of knowing what's going on. Like, Madara's decisions, you all bash Madara on how he's evil, but he's actually a tier above you guys when it comes to knowing about the world and existence because he's been, he's been living knowing this his whole, well, almost, like, later in his life he found this out so all his actions are based around that so he's basically telling you that everyone's cursed and there's no reason to live in this world because the fucking hope is gone and he said once this uh, this little tree sprouts that he will cast and finish Sikiyomi on the moon and on the world and do his own little fucking stupid ass plan. But why is there a fucking eye in that fucking tree in the first place? Like, what the, am I the only one? Like, why is there an eye in the bud? But as soon as Naruto, it cuts back to Naruto. He's about to get grabbed by a tree and get all his shit fucked up. And what do you know? The third Hokage comes to the rescue all y'all niggas doubted the third okay like oh he did he did he got blown up by a bijou bomb no this man came back like bitch i ain't out the game fuck your wood saves naruto I mean, I think the third Hokage is underrated, y'all. If y'all, if the third Hokage was a person, y'all would need to write an apology note for him. Because y'all been, like, trashing this man. He's in Hokage. He's, he, he's still on the same level as the other Hokages. He's just not as OP. So everyone's shocked that what's going on. Everybody's in the stance. The, everybody's just taking in what's, what happened this chapter. And that's basically where it ended, where the tree was about to sprout so yeah that's my review on it and uh i'm just saying everything started with a bitch 
this bitch gotta mess everything up. Everyone's cursed because of this bitch, but also everyone got chakra because of this bitch. So it's kind of a plus minus, negative positive. But I mean, it was that was a I give that chapter a 10 out of 10. That chapter deserved it. There was lots of action, informative pages, and it no pages were wasted. Sort of. I mean, a couple of pages were wasted, but overall this was a bomb ass chapter so that's my review guys and check you guys later peace